as the controversy around former Chief Justice Balakrishnan, presently the NHRC chairman, grows. The union law minister has said that some of these allegations are indeed serious. Speaking to NDTV, Mr. Virapa Moili said that no formal complaint has come to his ministry or any other government department. Earlier this week, reacting to former Supreme Court Judge V. R. Krishna Iyer's demand for a probe into reports of uh, the former Chief Justice's son-in-law amassing unexplained wealth during his tenure as Chief Justice, Mr. Moili had said the allegations would be verified. Let's take the case, uh, Mr. Moili, which is uh, currently in the news, which is that of the former Chief Justice Balakrishnan. There are two separate instances now where his name is cropped up. One, of course, is connected to Mr. Raja. Uh, do you still feel that you would like to give him the benefit of the doubt on the case of the judge who complained that he had been influenced by Mr. Raja? He said he complained to his Chief Justice. His Chief Justice said he wrote to Mr. Uh, Chief Justice Balakrishnan. Chief Justice Balakrishnan denies it. But do you still want to give him the benefit of the doubt? It's not a question of giving a benefit of I, I must speak on records. Right. At that point of time, you know, I, I have I had written a letter to the CJ, then CJ, right. Justice Balakrishnan. Yes. Then he wrote back that, you know, there was nothing in it. He did not get, you know, who was the, he could not name the, the, the who was involved in it, Raja, whether Raja was involved. Hmm. I got a very clear letter, you know, the, the, he, the clear he said, you know, the name, name of Raja was not mentioned. What about now this, this evidence which is emerging of the fact that the former Chief Justice's uh, daughter and son-in-law have amassed vast amounts of wealth exactly in the period where he was Chief Justice? Is that at least a matter of concern? This could lead to no, a, no, a, a potential investigation no, no, the by, by the investigating agency. The allegations is of, are of serious nature, no doubt about it. But, the question, but the question is that, you know, the, how far, you know, we have a prima facie case to get into this. And you know, the, but uh, the, the, the allegations are in the newspapers. Yes. But uh, we don't have anything in writing as far as my ministry is concerned. At the moment, at the moment former Chief Justice Balakrishnan is the head of the NHRC. Uh, should it require you to investigate him, you would have to go to the Supreme Court to file a complaint. So, you are, are you averse to that? Would you go ahead and do that no, if no, required? No, no. No, we, you know, we will not be, when, when it comes to the corruption, you know, we will not be averse to making investigation at a whatever forum. You will not but be the question wanting. is, but the question now is that uh, the, nothing concrete has come to our ministry or to the, any investigating okay. But at least what you see prima facie in the papers, it seems like a serious enough matter. No, no, of course, allegations are very serious in nature. They are very serious. I do agree with you.